What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Welcome back. We are getting into Ronald again. Um, this is probably going to be... Well, this is part of the full album review. We're doing the full popular monster album review. And I'm breaking them up into indi individual videos. And we're going to have the full video over on Patreon. I'm debating if I'm going to release this again. I probably won't. I'm probably going to skip the, the couple that I've done. And just keep them for the album review. I'm debating. But regardless, we're trying to connect how all the videos and all the songs like link together because he said that it's like a bigger picture, a bigger story. So that's what we're getting into. I hope you guys enjoy. If you do, smash the like, subscribe, check out the Patreon and the merch store. But let's get into Ronald again and see how this connects to the three or four songs. We've three, three songs before this one on the album. So let's get into it, baby. Let's go. All right. So what we were saying when we finished All My Life was maybe... This is where I, I have the story so far. Prequel, he gets like godlike powers, all this other stuff to see through the bullshit of society. Cool. Uh, next song was Popular Monster. I kind of thought that was like him going back to kind of earth, or back to reality, but not necessarily remembering what had happened right so he's just depressed and he's going through it and then he turns into a werewolf but his daughter pulls him into the light cool all my life is literally trying to get your shit back together and at the end he like literally falls off train tracks so that could be off the wagon and now we're getting into this so this is like the story i'm making in my head so far i don't know if it's accurate if i'm just like retarded but let's Okay. That kind of solidified, not necessarily, but it, it kind of reaffirms what I'm saying. Is like everything was fine, everything was good, and then now it's not again, you know? So that might kind of make sense. Okay, maybe they're the same people from prequel, sort of, and they just reawoke, reawoken, reawakened the shit inside of him. That kind of makes sense. So, like, they put the crown of thorns in him in prequel, then maybe sent him back down. And then he didn't remember what had happened. So now you got popular monster where he's just going through depression and all the bullshit of the world. All my life is he's trying to get it back together. And now it's like, oh, wait, here's. Like, here's your reminder of what had happened. I don't know. And now he's like going full bore with the powers and all that shit. But like once again, he's he's getting shot at and he's not getting hit. I feel like that symbolizes like he's always taking shots, but he's never actually getting hit. You know, that happens a lot. Yeah, now he goes into a wolf. Uh, I love tech. 
dude, I'm going to see them in September and text there, and I really hope this dude, they do this song together. Like, I really, really do. Design of the opposite of a divine. Oh. No! Yes. The hell is in front of you, set him behind. I can feel every sound of a human to come. believe in the time is upon us when all of our people are blind. Yo! Rain, saw it falling from a tower's dead plane. Head bang, Mandalay Bay Hotel on a lead cane. Sex change could get you caught up in death's range. He played sane, but really imitating Ed Gain. How do we get this way? Nigga, that shit to say, we get this way. Having a fit today, so you wanna make a bitch to gain. My son's mom, when God it was really wrong, I thought it was gone. The vomit searching for the sun, but I didn't go John Muhammad. So the devil's right here. So, like, this is where I think he gets his full-blown powers, right? Like, like Tech essentially sends him down to hell to fight the devil. And I'm assuming he ends up winning. And then he comes back, and I think the song after this is Watch the World Burn, which makes sense. So we're kind of making a full story here. Yeah. So, okay, so he also got his armor from prequel. But this is the first time he's wearing it. So. That's interesting because he found it, but Tech just gave it to him. Sort of. Hmm. Let me get me started on Sunday ticket. The NFL can go fuck themselves with that one. Good. All right. So we're trying to make connections. I love that song. It's a fantastic song. We're not here for the music review because we've done that already. Um. Okay. So story up to this point that I think we have. Prequel happens. He gets the crown of thorns in his head, which makes him be able to see through the bullshit of society he has um he finds his armor and like the dune thing i see it i really can't come up with anything other than like maybe he just gets sent back to reality in popular monster because he's he's depressed he doesn't really have like any godly powers technically turns into a werewolf his his daughter f brings him into the light then you have all my life where everything's kind of happy but he fucks it up and then literally falls off the train tracks then in this it starts with everything was okay but then i realized the world's a fucked up place and then goes into this whole thing and then those godlike people give him a reawaken him or some shit and then he goes and sees tech and then he gets his armor back he fights alex and i think wins and now we're going into the next one so this is It's so hard because nothing is... He's not making anything easy. Like, he's not saying, here's the story, you're welcome. It's like, figure it out, motherfucker. Which is really cool. So, we're going to jump into the next one. I don't remember which one is next. It might be Voices in My Head, actually, not Watch the World Burn. So, we're going to go into Voices in My Head, which actually would make a lot of sense because if you're... You literally went down to hell and fought the devil, Alex. <laughs> Now, in the beginning of Voices in in your in my head, he's in a insane asylum in a cage, dealing with that internally. So that might actually make a lot of sense. So let's get into that one. As always, if you guys enjoyed this, make sure you smash the like, subscribe, check out the Patreon, the merch store, the football podcast, all that good stuff's linked down below. And if you're watching the uh, full video, hang tight. If you're watching it individually, stay happy, stay healthy. Catch you in the next one. Later.